Shalom, shalom. So we're going to be deconstructing the book of Revelation. But first, let's talk about what it is and who wrote it. The book of Revelation is the final book and the epic conclusion to the Christian Bible. If you're unfamiliar, it's all of the doom and gloom, end of the world stuff that happens at the end of days during the second coming of Jesus Christ. Side note, the original name of this text in Greek is Apocalypsis with a K, and I'm pretty sure we should all just keep referring to it as that because that's pretty metal. So who wrote this amazing prophetic book that so much of Christian theology is based on? We have no idea. The author refers to himself in the text as John. That's it, just John. We don't really know who this particular John is. Now, many early Christian scholars believe that the John who wrote Revelation or Apocalypsis was John the Apostle. Now, John was the most beloved of all of the apostles. He was also the youngest, and he was the brother of James, who was also an apostle of Jesus. Now, despite the majority of Christians believing that John, the author of Revelation, is John the Apostle, it's important to note that the Apocalypse's text was written about 80 to 100 years after the death of Jesus. That would mean that if John the Apostle wrote it, he would have had to been very, very old at the time. The truth is, though, that we honestly have no idea the true identity of the person who wrote this particular text. 